again split to the top. McMurtry to the near side. The sun shining brightly on a frigid day. But this rivalry is heating it up. Brown throwing under pressure. Up for grabs. Intercepted. That's picked off by David Brown. Number 27. Brown to the 25. The 20 and dropped at the 19. Brown with his third interception. The sophomore out of Utica, New York. And in Earl Bruce's final appearance for Ohio State, his Buckeyes are really playing well. Take a look at number 55 right there in the screen. Holloman comes in. Just as he starts to throw, he's hit. He could not follow through with the arm. He was trying to go for number 40, John Colazar. So the ball flutters and just hangs on the center. Then it's David Brown, number 27, who picks it off, picks up an escort from William White, and puts him right in great field position for either the touchdown or at least a field goal attempt. Michigan's second turnover. One fumble and now an interception. The last time on the turnover, Ohio State scores. Let's see if they can this time. First down from the 18. Cooper, the fullback, for two. Second and eight. Well, we wonder what Earl Bruce said at halftime. Steve Alvarez has been checking that out. Thank you, Gary. The players uh, for Ohio State tell me it was relatively quiet in the locker room. They said Earl Bruce had a lot to say before the game, but when they went in at half, it was fairly quiet, and they all felt confident because they felt they were very much in this football game. So there were really no emotional speeches or anything at halftime. They just made their adjustments, and they obviously came out ready to play. Gary? I guess this is Michigan-Ohio State. You don't have to say a lot. Better believe it. Second down eight from the 16. Cooper, the single running back. Tupa back. The strike on the way to the five, spinning, fighting to the goal line. Just short of the goal line is Fitz Workman. First and goal, Ohio State. What a turnaround in this football game. What, what a great play here. Tupa comes back. As you said, passing has been the key. Sometimes you think they should run the football. The Fitz is where they've had all the success. A short passing game here. It was all Michigan early. It's all Ohio State right now. And Bo Schembechler, something he feared, that Earl Bruce's firing might give this team the added incentive if they really need it for a great series like this. And right now the Buckeyes trying to add to their lead. First and goal, Tupa diving, touchdown. zone to score the touchdown as that end zone is crowded with Ohio State Buckeye fans. 